Skimmer makes it easy to keep track of the tasks that you performed at a route stop. So we're going to demonstrate how to do that today using the service checklist. You can already see that uh, here is my route stop dashboard for the day. We're going to tap into the first customer. And uh, for sake of demonstration, we'll uh, skip all the other information and go down to our checklist. Now you can see we have uh, several items here that are available to swipe. These are items that we've set up beforehand, and uh, we discuss in other videos how you can set these up both as a universal list for everybody and as individual lists for individual customers. So after you've performed one of the checklist tasks, it's super easy to be able to mark it as finished. All we're going to do is swipe right, and there we see it's grayed out, and the message is changed to show that we have completed it. And uh, to demonstrate it again, we've changed from empty basket to emptied basket. We've changed from vacuum to vacuumed. Now, if you realize that we have more to do for one of these tasks that we have already marked as completed, and we want to unfinish them, then we can just swipe right again, and then they will be marked again as unfinished. And then, if you want to go back later and refinish them, it's just a simple matter of another right swipe. You'll notice also with two of the other items that the checklist has a nice feature in that it tracks how long it's been since you've performed one of these tasks. So, for these three that we've completed on top, if we come back a week or two later, it'll say done a week ago or done two weeks ago, and so we can know if it's time for us to perform these tasks again. And of course, uh, these will show up on the service email to the customer if you've configured it to do so. So that's all it takes. It's just a quick swipe to indicate on the checklist that you've completed a task.